Good morning. Morning. It's Josh. And Leslie. JNLAdventures.com. The world is our playground. That's right. So what's up today, Leslie? We're eating some chicky chicky. Yep, having some Chick-fil-A. Gotta love it. I got two chicken biscuits, one spicy, one regular. Yep, and I got the four count chicken minis. And I got- Times two. Yep, times two, and I pretty much got my breakfast for free, minus the drinks, so I'm mm -hmm. very happy. And I so. got some of mine free too. Mm-hmm. Yep, you got your, um, one of your biscuits free. You didn't get the spicy. Mm. These are so good. Mm -hmm. What are you guys doing today? <laughs> yeah, let us know down in the comments what your plans for today are. What you know, what awesomeness you've got going on. We've started um, recording several videos, but then things just didn't kind of go as planned. <laughs> mm hmm. Mm -hmm. Anyway, so we thought we would take y'all along today as much as we can. <laughs> and just kind of show y'all what our typical day is like. And um, I don't know, you'll probably see us eating a lot. Mm -hmm. <laughs> We're going to go get some work done on our vehicle. Yep. And man, my hair looks weird. <laughs> anyway, you look beautiful. You're so sweet. Mm, he is you. so sweet. <laughs> anyway, and um, so we're going to go get some done work done on the car. We got clients tonight. Of course, can't show you that. Nope. <laughs> and That's a secret. <laughs> be very, very quiet. Be very, very quiet. We have clients. <laughs> <laughs> but Josh can show you some of what he does, maybe. Yep, you can sit there and watch me do paperwork. No, <laughs> I don't think you'd enjoy that. <laughs> yeah, probably not. See me argue with insurance companies now, that wouldn't be you any fun You can show them either. our awesome office. Our awesome office, I yeah. meant to say our office, but it came out awesome. <laughs> but it is awesome, so whatever. Yeah, we can show them the office if you want. Yeah, we'll show you okay. our office. Okay. I don't know, would that be good? No, no it's fine. Anyway. And, All right, we're going to eat. Okay, see you in a few minutes. Bye. Okay, we finished eating. And we yummy, yummy. Oh, it was so good. We didn't think you guys wanted to sit there and watch us. You know, eat the whole thing. So you know. And I went out again on the drinks. Yeah, Josh she went did. out. I... So he gave me. <laughs> I asked him. I said, "Will you go get drinks?" And and he was like, "But I hurt myself." And he was all a little pouty. <laughs> <laughs> well, and I guess I should explain. Um, last week or this previous weekend, I went up to my mom's, and um, some relatives and I were helping her clean up her property. And, <clears throat> excuse me, I was toting around 50 pound garbage bags um, and I was trying to throw them into a dumpster and I didn't realize that there was a metal uh, uh, piece of pipe, or I'd, I guess it'd be a um, piece, almost like rebar is what it looked like, uh, sticking out of the side of the dumpster and about the size of a quarter maybe. And I caught my side on it and basically took several layers of skin off and I hit hard enough, I believe I bruised a rib because- yeah, it looks kind of rough. For a day or two, I was not able to uh, take a deep breath. And then if I move a certain way, it hurts like crazy. So I've been trying to take it easy and not overdo it. And, and I have been taking care of it. She him. has been amazing. She <laughs> made dinner last night and I didn't have to get up out of my recliner much at all, which was totally awesome so but today i was like but you've got your heated jacket <laughs> yes and i i still need to do the review on this this jacket is totally amazing um so what you know we may have to do the review later on this afternoon and post it separate but uh it is totally awesome um if you guys live anywhere in colder climates i highly recommend them especially the milwaukee ones because you can use the batteries for so many other things like during the summer, I take the power pack out and use it, you know, charge my phone or whatever. So I don't want to get too much into it because I don't want to give the whole review here. <laughs> anyway, so we were going to go into, um, since it's still November, yeah, still, um, we're doing our what we're thankful for, things we're thankful for. So go ahead, Leslie. Or do you want me to start? Uh, I need another minute. <laughs> okay. So first thing I'm grateful for is my health because yes even though i hurt myself the other day i was 
still able to keep working and I mean we got a lot of the, my mom's yard cleaned up and thanks to help f from a couple of relatives we got a lot done and even after I was hurt I was still able to keep working so I'm very grateful for my health I like that one I'm very grateful for our practice, for all the clients that we've ha we have. We've had several clients come in, and yes, I know I've said it before, but we've had more clients come in, so I'm really appreciative of that. And my third thing I'm thankful for is all of you, all of our subscribers. I looked, I checked our stats the other day. We have 26 subscribers now, and I just want to thank you all for subscribing to our channel and for all the awesome comments you leave and. I hope we've responded to just about all of them. Uh, we try very hard to, as soon as we see a comment posted, if if um, a response would work, we do try to respond as quickly as we can. But I just want to say, you know, personally from me, thank you to all of our subscribers. Okay, your turn, Leslie. Okay, which I'm thankful for. Mm -hmm. I'm thankful for a lot. It just tends to be the same thing over yep. and over. Like, you just wake up. I just wake up really appreciative. But mm -hmm. um, I'm going to go off of what you said and say my health. Because, um, I mean, I'm just, I feel good. I feel good. And I've been doing more stuff. And, um, you know, I think both mentally and physically I feel better. Um, you know, I've not uh, for a little while last year or well this year I keep thinking it's already the end mm -hmm. um, but you know for this year I've struggled a little bit since the like end of last year and the first of this year with some depression and I think it was just honestly just a stage of life thing like I just had was going through a little bit of stuff that I had to kind of go okay I need to regroup and look and change the way I'm looking at things and so I'm just really grateful that that's process through and it's led me to a just a better place mm -hmm. um i've been working this weekend on getting some cleaning done and i'm creating a little meditation place for myself which i'm really excited about but i'm not stressing about anything like it's just mm -hmm. i just take on a couple of things at a time and um so anyway i'm really grateful for my health and i'm grateful i'll say also within that I'm grateful for the Affordable Care Act um, <laughs> because when you um, are larger, it's harder to get insurance on your own. And so the Affordable Care Act, I know different people have different opinions, but I'll just say that from our perspective with Josh having had some medical issues mm -hmm. and me having um, my weight, um, I'm very grateful that we're able to get insurance and, you know, we get a lot of help with that. Um, it's in decreased, of course, as our income's increased, which, you know, it's frustrating at times. You feel like you work harder and, you know, get more taken away, but mm -hmm. I'm grateful we can do it. So I'm yep. really grateful for that. So I'm glad I was able to remember that. So mm -hmm. health and insurance. Mm -hmm. And then um, I'm just going to say I'm grateful for this beautiful day. Mm -hmm. and the sun shining is just makes such a difference in my life. Um, you know, it's so beautiful. I think they're closed. Uh oh This place we're going to, I think. Is it closed or do they just have the doors down because of the cold weather? Oh, maybe so. Yeah. I mean, yeah. Okay. Anyway, it's a beautiful day. And again, you know, we get to wake up kind of later. We don't have to wake up in a hurry and go to the office or whatever. And we're getting to go take some time to get our car fixed. And we actually already have paid for what we need to get done. So I'm excited about that. Mm -hmm. Um so yeah, there's just, you know, I'm just really thankful for where we are in our life. And sometimes I forget and, you know, Josh, um, is really good at, he is a very big media person. Like he <laughs> has a server with all kinds of movies and stuff on it, um, that he has bought and different things. And so I just love that too. <laughs> <laughs> all right. So we're here at the shop to get our car fixed so we're going to go ahead and end the video here um but we we might add some more here in a little bit so we'll uh keep you updated as to the progress talk to you later bye Recording. bye hey this is the live hey <laughs> all that's missing is heat and massage huh this is how you wait for, for your car to get fixed <laughs> hey everybody it's leslie and josh I was going to show you the duckies. It's kind of cold, so I'm not going to get out. 
but they're so beautiful. I don't see, know if a, you can see them. It's about 29 degrees right now, so yeah, it's a little chilly. But look at this view. Isn't that beautiful? It's so pretty, y'all. This is my happy place <laughs> with Josh. Mm -hmm. We were just talking about how in our next lifetime we're going to meet earlier, <laughs> like daycare earlier. <laughs> mm. yep. Before daycare. <laughs> Look at that view, y'all. The trees are losing some of their leaves, but it's still so beautiful. The sky is gorgeous. Mm -hmm. I'm so ready to be out exploring. Well, we are out exploring. We already do that a lot, but I'm excited to see other states. Yep. Look at that. It's so pretty, y'all. You know, we should show y'all the rest of the park. Let's do that. Okay. All right. There's more duckies, y'all. Look at those. Ducky duckies. I love duckies. <laughs> Look at those. Oh, they're so pretty. I want to know what their conversations are. They just have to have them. They're fun to watch. We'll have to show you all the ducks out at our place. Are those ducks too? Those are ducks. We'll have to bring some uh, bread down here and feed them one day. Yeah. And record feeding them. Feed the birds. Toppins. <laughs> Look at those. Oh, they're so beautiful. Oh, wait. Y'all see the one lone? The one lone one. Let's see if I can see. It's like really weird. It's, it's kind of out where I can't see it with the... Oh, look, there's the loan. Just biding its time. No particular place to go. Just floating. Isn't the water beautiful? Bet you that water's freaking cold. Wouldn't want to be out there naked. <laughs> Josh doesn't want to do the polar bear plunge. No. Mm. I wonder if it's sleeping. I read last week that the way they sleep is they tuck their head underneath their leg or something like that. Under their wing. Under their wing. It's taking a nap. It's telling me, go take a nap. You're tired. <laughs> I'm telling you we can because we have clients. Yes. He's a slave driver, y'all. Correct that whip. I'm terrible. <laughs> Look at the way the water s sparkles. <laughs> That's so pretty. You know, I was just thinking, uh, these are the kind of things, y'all, that I get fixated on. I'm like, can you say <laughs> slave driver? Is that bad? Is that politically incorrect nowadays? Because I don't mean any disrespect. <laughs> uh, we're just going to be us. Well, I just don't ever want to hurt anybody's feelings or anything. We don't do it with the intention of hurting anybody's no. feelings. We do it. We're just having fun. The duckies awake. It's so pretty, y'all. They're so beautiful. I love their long necks. And look at that tree. I'm always amazed by trees and how they, how their branches just twist. And I don't know, it makes me think about life, you know? They just go for the sun. Twist and turn and do what they need to do. Oh, this is a good view. You can see some of the houses. Hey, we're back. Hey, hey. So what are we doing now, Leslie? <laughs> what are you asking? 
<laughs> Just to mess with you. Do y'all get asked that like all the time by your husband? Like, what do you want to do today? Well, no, I just love to make you giggle. Whatever. <laughs> I'm you like do... the cruise ship director. No, because you every time I do it, you start giggling. So it's <laughs> I like to make you giggle. Can I have my donut? Take We're your at donut. Krispy Kreme. Yep. He makes he drove me to Krispy Kreme. Yeah, the blind guy drove her to Krispy Kreme. Because he wink, drives wink. me crazy. The reason I say wink, wink is because I can't do it, so I have to say it. So, anyway. Whatever. You know what, woman? <laughs> I got the apple pie. Let's see. I got blueberry. Doesn't that look good? Mm-hmm. All right, let me get a bite. Yum, yum. Drum roll. Mm. Do I need to edit in fireworks behind your head in that oh, moment? No. <laughs> but I haven't gotten to the filling part yet either. Mmm, <laughs> blueberry. Mm. I don't think she's impressed. Just touch it. It is good. Mm -hmm. You know what would make it really good? <laughs> what? This is the way a fat girl does food. It'd be really good warmed up with a scoop of ice cream on top. <laughs> <laughs> you may have to try that someday. Otherwise, I'd rather have my iced chocolate with the cream in the middle. That's my favorite donut. <laughs> but, it definitely isn't bad. <laughs> I'm bad. Is yours good? Mm hmm. It is, it is. I better hurry, or we're going to be late for the client. Mm hmm. All right, well, we're going to go ahead and stop here and finish eating. Bye bye. See you later. And we're back again. Yay! <laughs> Did you miss <laughs> us? We've been gone for like all of two seconds, maybe? Yeah. <laughs> That's a long time in video time. Yeah. <laughs> so, so what's up, Josh? Eh, what's up, Doc? <laughs> what are we doing, Josh? I don't know what we're doing. You're the one driving. <laughs> I'm just along for the ride. <laughs> I guess we're headed to um, the GMC dealership. And uh, we're going to see if they have a truck similar to the one we're going to get. Yay! So. We're doing some manifesting. That's right. We are. <laughs> we're staying positive. Mm-hmm. And yeah. we're just enjoying this beautiful day. That's right. This weather is too amazing to be stuck inside all day. Yeah. I, I never can decide, like, the way we do our practice, a lot of times we'll have, like, a client in the morning and then or maybe afternoon and then one in the e early evening and then one <laughs> late evening but sometimes I like that because I like the breaks but mm -hmm. sometimes it can make it kind of a long day oh yeah you know what well, if you had the choice of working all of your um, time together or if you'd like like an hour or two hour breaks in between kind of let us know what you'd like in the comments we, I like having a break I do too. I mean, it means we get to go outside and enjoy the weather some. We're not stuck inside all day. Yeah. So, I mean, yeah, it does spread out your work day a little bit more, but you get to go outside and have a nice lunch. And... If I had mastered the art of adulting, I would do progress notes during that break. <laughs> but I haven't mastered the art of adulting, nor do I know that I want to master the art of adulting. Adulting is so boring. <laughs> Oh, anyway. <laughs> so we just got some lunch. Yep. I bet you'll never guess what Josh had. Um, yeah, and I wasn't going to record that one. Those had to be the messiest McRibs I have ever had. <laughs> I mean, you they took a McRib and they put it in a box for a 10-piece chicken strip meal box. So, I mean, it's the box was about three times bigger than it needed to be. So instead of a nice, tightly contained sandwich I had it all over the box <laughs> so not but, only 
Oh, but they were good. And they still have McRibs. Like, hasn't oh, yeah. it been over a month? Yeah, it actually has been over yeah. a month. So I'm kind of impressed. So yeah. No, I want to make sure you guys know. I'm not complaining. They were still. They still tasted awesome. There just had to be the messiest McRibs I've ever had. I think that's still called complaining. But... It is not. <laughs> Welcome to Moe's. Welcome to Moe's. Oh, I love Moe's. Especially, had, especially the um, one here at, near us. I mean, the staff there, they're amazing. They know us. You know, every time I go in there, they're hey, Josh, how you doing? You and know? I get it delivered to the car. Yeah, because I go in and get it. <laughs> That's why every time I go in there, they're like, hey, Josh, how you doing? She goes in there, they're like, who are you? Uh, they do not. <laughs> they love me. You know, I'm teasing. They do. They're like, what? You came in? Yeah, they're shocked. <laughs> <laughs> but since it's like 30 degrees outside and I'm the one with the heated jacket, that means I'm delegated to go in, I guess. But that's and, okay. And then come summertime, it'll be a different thing. Like, but Josh, it's too hot. Uh-huh, <laughs> yeah. So it's either too hot or too cold, but either way, I'm the one that's supposedly going in all the time. But anyway. Hey, I have been going in more places. I went you in have. Walmart. I went to the pharmacy in Walmart hey. and... Walked you, around the store a little bit. You've been doing awesome. Yeah. Oh, we're getting a Denny's, y'all. Oh, yeah. She's excited. We're getting a Denny's. I love Denny's. We used to, Josh and I went on many late night dates at Denny's. <laughs> Remember? Oh, yeah. Well, when I, um, we, we actually, when was the last time we were there? I, see, I, I think I was working at HP, but you hadn't started yet. Yeah. Yeah. Um, I used to work for Hewlett Packard and I worked the late shift. So I would get done at like, um, the earliest I'd get done is like 9.30. The latest was like midnight. Yeah. So there were a couple of times where she'd come and pick me up from work. And we'd be like, okay, what do we want to do for dinner? And it's like, it's midnight. I'm ready to go to bed. But we'd go and have Denny's. I don't even know if that was dinner. It was usually our fourth meal. There you go. Fourth <laughs> meal. Oh, right. we're at the GMC. We are at the GMC dealership. So we're going to go ahead and stop the recording and flip it around and let's see what we get okay so i flipped the camera around and we're just kind of scoping out here seeing if we can find anything close to our truck we are looking for a 2020 gmc sierra denali is what we're looking for we're looking for a 3500 dually Let's see what we can find. I'm not seeing any doolies yet. I'm mm -hmm. seeing singles. I'd like to see the blue. I'd like to see, I don't see any blues, do you? Uh-uh. Or is that the blue right there? No, no, is it? I don't think so. It doesn't look like blue. No, it doesn't to me either. I don't see a single dually over here. Uh-uh. Did you on your side? Nope. Huh. I just wanted to see if we could even find the blue. That's kind of cool. That's a chocolate one. Okay. I don't want chocolate, but I'm just saying... Well, I'd probably do want chocolate, but... You don't want a chocolate color truck. <laughs> That's a pretty blue. Is that it going to be? I think so. That's beautiful. Kind of that dark blue, yeah. yeah. Hold on, let me grab the camera out of the mountain. I'll show you guys what we're looking at. Put your window all the way down. There. Oh, yeah. I think that's the blue the truck's going to be. That's pretty. I hope we can only find a truck that looked like that. Well, it's because it's going to be special for us. That's right. Well, we don't want a truck that's been sitting in a lot anyway. We want a one fresh off the that's right. car hauler. So. I don't see any other trucks. I see a lot of SUVs. All righty. Well, it was worth a look. Let's go ahead and head to the office. Okay, we're going to head back to the office. So, see you in a little bit. Well, wait, I was oh. going to tell them oh, something. Okay. You want me to flip it back around yeah. or? 
Wait, what's that one there? Is that no? That's a single. That isn't a dually. Uh -uh. That was a single. That was not a dually. Okay. <sighs> oh darn! Looks like they're gonna have to special order ours for us. Doesn't that just hurt your feelings? Yep. <laughs> All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and stop recording for just a second, long enough to flip the camera around, and Leslie has something she wants to say, so. We'll be, be back with and you in a we're second. back with you, again. We <laughs> flipped the camera back around. GMC dealership was a dud, they didn't have our truck. Yeah, so. yeah, yeah. But you we tried. That. You do it better. See, I wanna be able to make those noises, that's my. Um, <clears throat> dream in life. <laughs> <laughs> That's your dream. <laughs> well, it's I, good to have goals. <laughs> <laughs> I was just about to say that. Now, I I actually used to be a DJ, you know, several years ago. So I I've tried to learn different accents and different sound effects and you know all that stuff. This uh, is. I think I'm going the wrong way. You're gonna get on the freeway, but that's okay. You can get off at the Oak exit. Okay. So all, all is right. well. Oh, here, let me, you're not really in frame here. Let me turn them out. There we go. So we're both kind of. I was going to say that I was kind of disappointed when I found out that if you buy a brand new vehicle and they put a bow on it, it's only for a picture, really. Yeah. You don't get to keep the bow. Nope. You don't get I to keep the keep bow. I want to keep the bow. What would you do with it? I don't know. You can't have it on there while you're driving. The first thing we'd have to do is take it off. I guess that's true. <laughs> So yeah, we can have it on there for a picture if you want, but we wouldn't have any use for it after that. I just don't understand. In all the car commercials where people get new vehicles, they have the big bow on their vehicle. That's just for the... Do you ever see them driving it with that bow on there? Well, I don't think I would drive with it on there, but <laughs> I thought it would be mine. Nope. Those are expensive. They reuse those suckers. But it's at the people's houses. Do they come back and get the bow? Yep. That's all, that's all staged. Well, I don't know. It's breaking my little world. Aww. I'll have him put a, a purple bow on the truck just for you. Yeah. But you won't get to keep the bow. I want to keep a purple bow. Well, maybe if they do it in purple, you might get to. We'll see. <laughs> I think it'd look better with a red bow on it, but no. you know, we'll have him do purple and just for you. So, and I don't want one of those, like, cloth bows. Like, they have the ones that look like real Christmas present bows. Mm-hmm. You know? You don't like the cloth ones? No. Those are, I think those are more upscale. They, they look, don't they look fancier. They don't look shiny and magical. It, if they do it out of, what is that? I'm trying to remember what the material is that looks like that. It, it isn't silk, but there's a material that looks shiny like the plastic ribbon does. I don't know. So if any of you know what that is, put, go ahead and put it in the comments below. What material? <laughs> Is shiny like the the uh, plastic ribbon. They're gonna be like, y'all should have just stayed gone a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> what is this? <laughs> right. We we actually got feedback from a um, subscriber that said they missed us, and we appreciate that. And we we're, yeah. you know we're sorry we've been kind of gone. I mean, like I said, I was out at my mom's working, and I hurt my side, and you know, so I haven't been feeling good. And, well, and I, we started some videos. I actually, I started a video when you were gone on Saturday. Mm -hmm. And then I was like, didn't put it up. And then we started a video on Sunday. And didn't put it and up. And didn't put it up. <laughs> so, yeah, we got all sorts of video clips and stuff. And we might throw some compilations together and put up, you know. Yeah. But we'll see. I, I, I like what we're doing here as far as recording bits and pieces of one day and then posting that. Yeah. So, I don't know. We try to make every day special. Yes. You know, and, uh, you know, I love some of the videos where, um, people show like when they first get up and making breakfast and all that <laughs> stuff. And one of these days, again, when I grow up, I might do some of that. <laughs> hey, that, that's one philosophy we have. We may get older, but we refuse to grow up. <laughs> what? What? I love you. I love you too. Show them the Christmas tree. All right. We start moving, right, as I'm trying to record our fake-looking Christmas tree. <laughs>
Actually, it looks better this year. I think they fluffed it up a little bit more. That's the sky you're looking at. No, I'm looking at the tree. 